This is Witchspace News for Friday the 31st of May 2019 ...I'm Commander Burr. In this weeks news ...the Thargoids appearance may have been leaked ...details of the first Elite Rank speed run are now public ...the first interstellar initiative comes to an end. If you enjoy our content please remember to hit like and subscribe and click the little bell icon to get a notification next time we upload a new video. Remember you can also come and join us on the Burr Pit Discord server and if you want to help support the work of this channel then you'll also find us on Patreon. Links to both of those and where you can also find us on all your favourite social media platforms are in the description below. I'm about to talk about some massive potential spoilers here the images in question have pretty much been covered by all the major elite YouTubers at this point but in case you've missed them or want to avoid them I'd stop watching now. I've talked previously about some recent leaks that appear to be coming from a source inside Frontier that are discussing the 2020 update to Elite and what it apparently contains. Well that same source has posted what they're saying is the appearance of the actual Thargoids. This is not the first time we've seen images claiming to be leaked Thargoids but in this latest image they do look somewhat more complete. The previous leaked Thargoid image from a few months back was quickly picked up by Frontier who did claim it was their own but said that the Thargoid design had moved on significantly since then. This latest image clearly shares some design DNA with that image that was leaked previously and on the new Thargoid Frontier have said absolutely nothing. If this is what we're facing in the first person in 2020 I couldn't honestly be more excited. That update can't come soon enough. I mentioned a couple of weeks back that the master of elite themed tutorials on YouTube Commander Exegius was to host an elite rank speedrun competition. Well the rules for the competition are now live and you have until midnight GMT on Friday the 14th of June to register. Entries must be submitted by midnight on Sunday June the 16th. Exegius himself managed the feat in 11 hours and 47 minutes on a continuous livestream and it's expected that any winning entries will need to be around the 8 hour mark to win. The competition is being sponsored by Frontier Developments and includes Steam gift cards and various paint packs for the winners. If you're interested in participating then head over to the Exegius Level 11 Discord to get started. Links to everything you need are below. And finally the inaugural Interstellar Initiative ended in game this week with the final phase being a combative face off between rival corporations Zenday Partners and Segnen Exchange. The incumbent Zenday Partners won the exchange of gunfire and as a result the galaxy now has a new advanced multi cannon to add to the mix when facing off against the Thargoids. Perhaps unsurprisingly not everyone was happy with how the new format of the Interstellar Initiative played out and there's a thread on the official forums where you can vent your opinions on the multi week event. Frontier have said that they're taking some lessons from the initiative and will bring those lessons to bear in future initiatives. The next of which is entitled The Enclave and that is taking place sometime in July. Until then the galaxy will return to the weekly community goal format cycling every Thursday so look out for that next week to see what you can get involved in. That's it for now. Thank you so much for making it this far. We'll be back later this week with more videos. Until then ….o7 CMDRs follow the greens on the way out and do keep clear of the toast rack. We very much look forward to seeing you next time. <laughs>